Hello, level four. Hello, in course of Eng 4000, Renewable and Sustainable Energy. This is the experiment number one. This experiment about wind energy. The objective of this experiment is to show how wind energy drive wind turbine and how the tilt angle effect generated power. Now we should consider in this experiment three different three different cases or conditions. So the first condition should be considered three different distance between fan and wind turbine. Use distance 20, 40, and 60 centimeter. Then consider three different speeds for fan. Should be used low, medium, and high of speed using this fan. Then should be considered also four different blades angle of turbine. This angle is 0, 30, 60, and 90 degree. Now we'll start the experiment. We need in this experiment wind turbine with DC motor inside it and with three blades. We need multimeter to measure the output voltage of wind turbine. We need also anemometer to measure the wind speed. We need also fan. Now should be considered three things to do this experiment. Should be use the fan speed with the three different speed, one, two, and three. That's mean low, medium, and high. Also, we need the distance between fan and wind turbine after 20 centimeter, then after 40 centimeter, then after 60 centimeter. For wind turbine, we need we need to change the blood's angle from 0, then 30, then 60, and 90. Now we'll connect the, now we'll connect the multimeter to be voltmeter to measure with respect to turbine, wind turbine, to measure the output voltage. So this is the connection now with voltmeter. In this experiment, given three tables, this table depends on the distance and fan speed. So the first table with respect to distance 20 centimeter, then the second one with, the, with 40 centimeter and 60 centimeter for table three. So in step number one, we need to find first the wind speed using a pneumometer with respect to unit meter per second. So we need now to solve together, to measure together, the wind speed in table one, two, and three depends on fan speed when given low, medium, and high. Uh, measure the wind speed when using fan speed at low and at 20 centimeter. Then measure, will measure the wind speed equal 1.26 now we'll change the fan speed to be at medium again we measure now the wind speed at this point the last one using now the high fan speed Now we'll do same step, but now with the distance 40 centimeter. So again, we'll measure the wind speed using an emometer and use different fan speed, starting from low, medium, and high, and also use same steps when in distance 60 centimeter and record the value of wind speed in a table. Now we'll start in the second step. Now we'll change the fan speed to be at low and we need to measure the voltage, output voltage of wind turbine at 20 centimeter when changing the blood angle from 0, 30, 60 to 90. Now we'll starting, okay, we'll start using the low fan speed with angle 0. Now we'll measure the value of the value of output voltage equal zero. Now we'll change the value to be 30. 
Now we'll change the blood's angle to be at 60. This is the angle 60. Now we'll measure the value of output voltage of turbine equal approximately 1.2.1. Now at the 90 of blood angle, the reading again will be zero. Now we'll change the fan speed to be at medium and two. Then we'll change, we'll starting now from 90. So at 90 again, the reading of output voltage of turbine equal again zero. Now we'll change the angle to be at 60. So this is 60 now. The reading now equal approximately 2.9. Now we'll change the fan speed to be at high. And again, we'll change the blood from 0, 30, 60, then 90. And again, we'll measure the output voltage of wind turbine. Okay, and we'll, we'll uh, measure the value and record in a table. Also, again, we'll complete the second and third table, depends on the distance. Now we'll move the turbine to be after 40, then after second, uh, 60 centimeter. Now this is the final measurements of this experiment. We find wind speed in meter per second and wind turbine output in volt. Good luck.